So this is DLSS 3.5.5.0 uh, version and currently using Epic except for hair quality which is medium and currently using DLAA and frame generation on. Okay. Now here you can see I'm using okay 86 percent memory VRAM all right 86 percent VRAM and 90 800 FPS all right no shimmering reflections are decent and the frame time is a plane okay you can see the frame time is a, like a plane is a straight line all right this is good stable I'm gonna do what I'm gonna do is turn to ultra performance and you can see it's shimmering and of course it's shimmering because it's ultra performance right uh, it, the, 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 the performance indeed increased all right but the memory usage don't decrease all right don't do not decrease uh, which is a problem because when you increase the DLIA it turns to 92 percent all right it turns to 92 percent and my FPS have down to 74 which is about 25 percent decrease all right there so you might be thinking about this is a DLSS issues not a not a game issues right no this is a game issue all right as i mentioned this is a dlss 3.5.10.0 version which is not the default stalker 2 version using stalker 2 default was using 3.7.0 i'm going to change it to 3.7.0 and you will see the difference okay so this is a default DLSS version, which is 3.7.0, and I got identical FPS performance, 84 memory usage, sorry, VRAM usage, and and yeah, no shimmering, no pixelated, no flickering. Now I'm gonna switch down to performance or ultra performance. All right. I got shimmering, flickering. That's normal because it's ultra performance. I got 80%, which is about 4% lower VRAM usage, and I got 140 FPS. All right. What I'm gonna do? Okay. What I'm gonna do is change back to ultra quality uh, to, to the LAA, and you can see it's 90%. VRAM usage and I got only 74 FPS all right which are the same situation in 3.5.10 DLFS version I'm gonna repeat again and again and see is there any VRAM usage difference I go back go back to 86 percent wow okay so switching back to from DLA to perform ultra performance will increase five percent each each time okay well it will increase five percent of your memory usage all right so i'm gonna think back to the laa and you can see i start oh, okay still have 90 percent okay 90 percent all right but i only have 75 fps right now and i got shimmering shimmering reflections all right shimmering reflections over there over here everywhere and I only have I, I sometimes even have 60 FPS all right so now so later I'm gonna I'm gonna show you the 3.8.10.0 DLSS version which is the latest version of DLSS you will see um, what's the difference and how the implications might to a massive mess um, on the optimization. So this this is a 3.8.10.0 DSS version. A similar FPS performance, DLAA, no flickering, no shimmering. Alright. 84 memory consumption. 
I'm gonna switch back to Ultra Performance. Shimmering, 80% memory usage, 140 FPS. And then... You can see the pixelated reflections is still here and the memory consumption has increased to 90% alright so in this three samples you can see that DLSS version alright does not affect your your image quality after you toggling or toggling the the, the image quality once you started the game and more importantly it, this proves that there might be a memory leak issues in the LSS because because um, for example I changed to I changed to FSR with, uh, uh, sorry I changed to T TAA okay TAA I got 100 FPS. I got normal. You see, I got normal reflections. But if I go back to the ELSS, I got shimmering. You see, I got shimmering stuff. I got high memory VRAM usage. I got uh, shimmering. Although the FPS go back to normal, which is 100 FPS, but the shimmering is still here. All right. The shimmering is still here. So, yeah, the method is not completely... It's not completely broken, but um, it's not gonna satisfy your, your gameplay experience. For example, I'm using... I'm gonna from switch from DLSS to FSR. See, I got normal reflections. I got no shimmering. I got even better performance too. But once I switch... Back to DLSS. For example, DLAA. I still got shimmering and ref and and weird reflections and and the the memory consumption is still freaking high. So, if you want to play the game with good or decent performance, with uh, with beautiful image quality, it's not recommended to use DLAA or DLSS unless you're not gonna die or not gonna toggle the DLSS setting in the whole game gameplay otherwise you might experience FPS drop stuttering and memory consumption and memory leak so I so if you like my content if you like my video please leave a like as a motivation for me and I hope you have a nice day and see you later in this in the next video